hi this tutorial is on needle tatting and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a basic ring just like this okay what you're going to need is a needle there's different sizes of, of needles um, and which one uh, you choose to use it depends on the size of thread that you're gonna use. Uh, this one, the black one, is a little thicker than the one I'm gonna be using today, so for that I will be using like a thicker needle. And it comes in a packet and a little uh, tube like this, and it has the size and everything on that. Okay, well first, you, uh, you grab your needle, and it has a little uh you know the little needle eye right there so you put your thread to there mm, having a little trouble putting it in there okay here it comes Okay, so for a ring, you don't really need to leave a, a long tail, maybe two inches. And what you're going to do is you're going to hold the thread with your needle, just like that. And tatting, what you work with tatting, it's double stitches. So you make a double stitch. So you go one, two. So we made two double stitches. Now let's see that on slow. Okay, one thing, when you're holding your, your your thread with your needle right there, don't let go until you finish a whole double stitch. So that's not a finished one. That's a finished one. Then you can let go. Okay, so we're going to make a circle. So we're going to do, let's see let's do five double stitches a picot which is this little two, this little uh, uh, loop right here that's a picot 
Okay, so we're going to do, we have one, two, three, four, five. You see, I don't know if you can see the little knots. It makes like little knots in the bottom, and each each double stitch, it's like two little loops on the on the needle. So, okay. Now to do a pika. you hold it right there you don't let it come together to our last double crush uh, double stitch you hold it right there and it all depends how big your pick cuts gonna be you can do it closer or you can make it bigger it all depends what you want to do or your pattern says so let's finish that and then you slide it and then you made a little pick up. let's do that in slow motion Okay, so now that we have we have our pick up, we're gonna do five more double st uh, stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, five doing five sorry and it's very easy to take a stitches if you make a mistake okay so now we're gonna close our ring so what you do is you pull but don't let your loop go through there see that Hold it right there because you have to put your needle in there. See? And we have a little ring. Okay, let's do it in slow motion.
okay so there we have a ring so now what you have to do is just close it with the little knot and there we have a ring and you can add as many peacocks as you want like this one um, for my next video we'll be doing a little butterfly just like this I hope this tutorial was helpful to you and don't forget to subscribe thank you for watching Bye.